Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. My name is Soham and today I'm reacting to Karma Police by Radiohead. And after my reaction to No Surprises, which was a wonderful song, many of you in the comments let me know that I should react to more stuff off of the OK Computer album. So I'm excited to do that here. Radiohead is one of those bands that I just need to know more about. I need to listen to them, digest them sonically, and I'm excited to get into it. I hope you are as well. Please hit that subscribe button if you like my reactions. It does help out a lot. And without further ado, let's just jump into it. What kind of car is this? I love the chords, right? The guitar strumming along. I love that there's like a steady drum beat and the pianos, I feel like are highlighting some of the very interesting, uh, I guess, beats within this rhythm here. Uh, just across the first you know, minute and a half that I've listened to. I really like it. And now that we're in this chorus here, I wanna go back because I love that one like, there's like one or two notes that maybe you guys know in your heart what they are, but they like hit me differently. I don't know. Okay. That one, that one. This is what you get. Oh, this these piano notes. You get when you mess with us. Mm. Love it. This is what you get. Ah. This is what you get when you mess with us. Mm. This poor guy. What, why are they? Why? I don't. I, I feel like I've missed a lot of the interpretation of the song up until this point. Why are we running him over? And why is he in the in the car so like chill about it? Like my only intuition about that, even with the song title by itself, is that we have some people who are karma police in society, right? They want to instill their value. They're they, they're moralists. They want to instill their values over everybody. You know, point out everybody's wrongdoings. Point out how everybody else is flawed when they have those same flaws themselves, right? So they're running over other people and they're like you know fine ride but they're not doing so from a happy place they're doing so from a place of their own contempt for themselves so i i don't know is it like a is it a story about hypocrisy i i need some help in the comments please let me know that's my best shot right now
they're doing with the the visuals here i don't really comment much on videography just because that's not an area of my own expertise but i love that they switched perspectives right we were in the car the entire way through panning back and forth rotating and then finally we see the front on view of the person that we're actually running down in this car he's scared for his life right he's doing his best and now he's finally collapsed i i love that switch up and it pairs well with the change i guess into this bridge section it's really good. It's really captivating. interesting end to the song i musically and visually what ah well there it is karma police by radiohead i really like that i i got chills <laughs> towards the end right there i so my yeah my initial speculation towards this idea of hypocrisy right is the fact that you know we do things onto others that we wouldn't want done onto ourselves since as soon as the person F turns around right he's tired upset at all of this situation he turns around he faces the music and he sees that actually i can actually impact them the same way they're impacting me right they have they're equally as flawed uh as i am and so being able to you know light the match and then throw it back with 10 times force and i don't want to say 10 times force but of course running somebody down in a car versus setting their car on fire those are both e not equally bad they're both those are both bad things don't do those things but I guess in the metaphorical context here, what I'm trying to get at is that people are going to be in a protective, uh, protective state, right? Anytime somebody, you know, let's say mischaracterizes us or calls, uh, uh, calls our morality into question, we become defensive and naturally so. And it sucks, especially when it's coming from a hypocritical place. So if somebody else is doing those same things by doing a bad action or trying to run you over, well, who are you in now the wrong to, you know, set their car back on fire? I mean, you know, two wrongs don't necessarily make a right, but it does explain a whole lot of people's behavior and naturally so. So I don't even know <laughs> in the whole scope of the song if that's correct so let me know again in the comment section down below if my interpretation is correct what is the correct interpretation regardless of the interpretation the music itself was very engaging visually i was very engaged i just i really like how simple radiohead's music kind of is and there's good production towards the uh latter half of the song otherwise it's you know it's still good production but it's more simplistic right but now they're adding like screeching sounds in the back that are slowly uh kind of oscillating in your ear and kind of tearing those eardrums apart engaging with the fire it's almost like mapping on to uh, one to one and i guess the last comment that i have to make uh and i apologize for all my scatterbrained comments i just try to get them out as i have them uh, my last comment i'll make is that somewhere in the middle or maybe the 30 percent section of the song i was getting a lot of uh kind of associations memory associations to muse and then if any of you ever listen to muse it's not this is not the same not at all right i'm not saying that 
but somehow in his voice i can hear aspects of muse and i like that you know i like that i can <laughs> say that i hear the similarities because i love muse they're a wonderful group uh and radiohead is a wonderful group i'm just excited to get into more radiohead reactions let me some uh, uh let me know about some more recommendations in the comment section down below and uh yeah while you're down there hit the subscribe button too it helps me out a lot and yeah let's just end right there i hope you have a great rest of your day everyone take care and peace